All right, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Far Cry 5. I've actually, okay, cool, there he is. Uh, I guess you guys can't see it, but Keith is also playing this now. So, I have played uh, Far Cry 3 before. I've never touched any of the other Far Cry games. I've played through the entirety of 3, and I was recording it for a post-commentary series for YouTube uh, the first summer that I was doing Let's Plays for, and then I realized post-commentary is a pain in the ass, and I threw away all the footage. Actually, maybe I still have that footage if I went looking. Um, but one of the cool features that they, they've been integrating more is co-op. I, I think Ubisoft in general has been trying to uh, cram co-op in like further into their games because, you know, Division, uh, Ghost Recon, Wildlands, this, and so on and so forth. Um, and so I'm really, uh, I'm really excited to be playing this because I will be playing with Keith. And so we're going to be starting at about the same time. Uh, and I'm just going to throw it on probably normal difficulty. Hopefully I can change the difficulty as I go along. And we're going to be a dude. There we go. Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious, militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. How? Who? Their leader. Joseph C. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Over. 10 4 over and on. 
Maybe we should have brought Nancy along with us instead of the Proby. These Peggy's wouldn't fuck with her. Pratt? Why do you keep calling them Peggy's? Project at Eden's Gate. P.E.G. Peggy's is what the locals call them. You know, they started off harmless enough a few years back, but now they are armed to the teeth. You know, they're looking for a fight. Are you scared, Sheriff? We're here. Compound's just below. Church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rook, pardon me. Stay loose. What are they doing here? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, Nancy. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much out here. They'll respect a 9mm. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet, Marshal. You're about to get your name in the paper. You'll be fine. Something is coming. You can feel it, can you? We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. That is why we started the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us. Take our guns. Take our freedom. Take our faith. We will not let them. Sheriff, come on. Hold on, Marshal. We will not let their greed, or their immorality, or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff, you're not There will be no more afraid. suffering. Find it. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Oh, do not touch that service weapon! Yeah. Hold on and don't stand down! Stand down! Stand down. Stand down. Stand down. Everyone calm down! We knew this moment would come. We were prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. saw when the lamb opened the 
first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold, it was White Horse. And hell fought with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. Rook, put the cuffs on him. Put down your guns. Take your friends. And walk away. Come on, rookie. God is watching us. And he will judge you on what you choose in this moment. God damn it, rookie. Sheriff, hold on, Marshal. Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. We're leaving, Rook. What the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Sheriff, get back there. Shut up and listen. You put those cuffs on him. None of us get out of here alive. I will have you all arrested. So be it. Well, that was easy. Thanks for watching, everybody. Um... I guess it's been Far Cry 5. I wonder where, I wonder where I was supposed to call up. Maybe, maybe Keith could have sit, sat in the helicopter with me. That would have been cool. Either way, this is a fun game. And, uh, can't wait to play more. Uh, maybe, at some point. Uh, let's see if Far, Far Cry 6 is a little bit longer. I heard, um, I heard Far Cry 4 was like 15 minutes long. So maybe I'll go back and play that next. Who knows? Uh, but I guess, uh, thanks for watching, I'll, I'll see you whenever they make another one of these games. That was neat.